We must get ready for the worst. The enemies are preparing to attack, and we need to support our soldiers to help them stop the assault. All right, so I need to give them some food. Let's prepare, prepare that quickly. <laughs> we just started, and you already got sick from being in the rain. Thanks, game. Ah, that's gonna cost me lumber. Alright, whatever. I know, I know. If you put it here, it's safe. I just don't know what I want to put in there. Oh, seriously? Now I need materials? even eat without that, can you? Oh, you can. If I use my hotkey, I can eat. No fiber. I told you to sleep. And you go back to sleep. I can just get that to get out of my way. Oh, jeez. Dead. Alright, well, um, I know it's not what you want to see. I'm going to go ahead and load, and we're going to redo some of this stuff. I don't want to, I, I, I want to see if I can get through this without any casualties. As far as replaying some of that goes, I'll try to speed speed up what you see, since you've already seen it, and we'll be right back at things. Down, drink, 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 drink. Oh, never mind. Collect that for me. Alright, so we'll go back to drinking, 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 building. I need to give you the ballista parts. How are we doing? Got a wounded dude. Need to give him some food. can finally eat. You know you got sick. Good job.
Yeah, it took it to build that, I thought. Before I can make any arrows, I still need iron, and that's going to be a while before the game lets me make it. Ready full, dude. This down, this down, put it all down. You just need to bring the shovel or the torch. ways away. Uh, this is a person that wants to trade for food, 
This person wants to trade for medicine. Um, I, was, I was hoping I could get there in time, but it's almost daytime, so. Go and grab all this stuff again then. And we'll leave the dirty water. Even if I'm not collecting anything by searching it now, I don't have to... I can, I can just collect it later. here again? Oh, I guess I didn't put anything there. Alright, let's take a look. Drop off the key. Uh, leave the meat. Take armor. X. Sword. Okay, this is, I guess, what we what we're bringing back. We must get ready for the worst. The enemies are preparing to attack and we need to support our soldiers to help them stop the assault. Recovered, recovered, recovered. Alright, let's see here. Water, water, fleet and water, water. Nine to forty one. That's not good. Oh, come on, that's also not good. Fiber, thanks, game. <laughs> it's 
get some arrows. Almost there. doing well. Um, use more food than fur later. We got other pressing needs. Oops. Three axes. Can't repair this without any fiber. Until these things finish, I can't get any fiber. wall damage. I gave them a brick. They lost rock, lost armor, lost mini axes, but nobody died. Can't get them their armor back until I get some fiber. There we go. Needed that very badly. Wake up, repair that. I need it first, and then I can give them the food once I'm ready. Alright, you can sleep. Scout, scout, scavenge. My people need more food. Okay, uh, looks like they finally calmed down from earlier. Maybe we'll have to look for food in the high city. I don't have any torches. I don't think I need a shovel for that part of the city, so we'll, we'll move on without it. Start here and move our way to the east. Yeah, that sounds fine. Achievement unlocked, reconnaissance. Before we move on, I want to make sure there's nothing left to grab from here. Food? Uh, I don't know. I'll leave the food open. 
I was gonna bring the food over there because that's that's a person that wants to buy my food. I'll put it right here for now. It's already moved over there, anyways. I I know I am here looking for food and food stuffs here, but those I was kind of intending to trade. Yeah, here's a lot more food. I think that's what we'll bring in. Let's see, do I have enough food for everybody? Let me think here. I 
need to bring in some meat. I'm, I mean, I should be able to get rats to, to feed my people, but not sure I do have rats. There's no guarantee I have rats. I just don't want to give up the dried meat because it's it's fairly valuable. We'll take a gamble. Maurice greets you, looking more tired than ever. You relay to her the news of your escapade to the guard outpost. As you talk, she becomes more and more crestfallen. By the end, she is visibly overwhelmed. Even Galvik's absence among the dead fails to console her. Finally, she composes herself. Reese now turns to another serious matter, the Bastion supplies. The soldiers are already at half rations, and yet they may soon run out of food and water. Take care of it, she orders angrily. It's what you're here for. Reese's warnings leave no doubt as to your current priorities. She currently says her goodbyes. She's still struggling to come to terms with what has to happen. Clearly, Galvik was very important to her. Under normal circumstances, you would perhaps pity her. As things stand, though, you have no time to waste on feelings. There's work to be done. Night was calm, but the enemy assault can come any day, and we must prepare for it. We should use this chance to help the soldiers at the Bastion. Yes, there's rat's food. I don't have any herbs. Uh, almost ready, so I'll just have to wait for that. Here, you are thirsty. I just feel like you're so far away. Take care of the soldiers in a minute. get everything I really need. Let's see about upgrading some of this stuff. I will need bricks. Oops. Didn't finish setting the trap.
I hope I still have room for a water collector there. I'd be sad if I can't. Establish this uh, city with my trader for once. Sleep, sleep, sleep. Everybody's fine. There's not really nothing they can do. I already scouted. Start here and work my way back down. Take this food over to the Temple of the Godfather. One, one second. I'd run back north and maybe trade what I can for some medical supplies. I don't know. We'll see how this all plays out. It's kind of a long run, but I ended up having... I, I need to bring the keys back down south. I need to change my plans. So let's see. Let's get the food. Medicine. I'll leave the water. Water can be good for trading, but that's not enough water anyways. Well, she says she needs food. She actually trades you food. So, for example, uh, like if I offer her this dried meat, she wouldn't really give me a whole lot for it. Like even she would not even want the planks. But if, for example, I offer her this medicine, like suddenly, yeah, she'll she'll take it. So she needs medicine, not food. She's giving you food. Do I need more iron, more bricks? I don't know. Cloth. I need cloth, actually, but realistically, I should just get as much food as I can for now. Trade for two dried meat. This will have to do four dried, four vegetables, one meat. I mean, it's. I know I've got some stacks of it elsewhere, so I, 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 if I trade for five, I definitely have to carry some. I don't know how many I have. I probably have three or so, but this, this is fine for now. Um, I'm sure I could squeeze out a little more from her if I just clicked around a lot. I don't want to take all day doing this, so we'll just trade for for this from this modest amount of resources. There's more stuff here to search, but I'm completely full on things, anyways. And her job is not really to be searching. Her job is to be trading with her limited backpack space. So I don't want to take her into the city as many as I want to avoid taking her into the city as many times as possible because she has 
the least amount of backpack space. Take that. One of these keys does the church, one of the other does something else, so let's let's go and open up the front door. You approach the city gate from the market to the harbor. It'll be an incredibly convenient shortcut for your nightly journeys. The door, however, is solid and definitely shut. If Isners hadn't been able to breach it, you need a key, but where could it be? The key you found fits perfectly, and the gate between the market and the harbor is open. Alright, that'll free up at least one spot. I'll need to bring the other key to the, to the church of what I'm heading to. I traded away my medicine to get some food. Now I'm going to trade my food away to get some medicine. If I'm doing it right, I will actually make a profit. <laughs> you approach an old chapel to the forefather. The door is shut, but you remember inside there is a tunnel connecting with the temple's courtyard. The priests manage to shut the temple's gate, cutting themselves off from the Izmirs. You could reach them through the chapel tunnel, but the door is firmly locked. You need a key. Where could it be? Key brought fits perfectly, and the tunnel containing the chapel with the temple courtyard is open. You're at the entrance of the tunnel leading back to the chapel outside the temple walls. Wait, what? Oh, okay, yeah, here we are. I did do it wrong. So there's a lot to search, but again, that's not her job. Her job is, uh, is to keep going through the city. Or keep trading. Any time left she has after, sure. But right now, we need to worry about other stuff. You open the heavy, massive door, and then you enter the temple. When you find yourself in the main nave, you pause on surprise. The temple is almost as crowded as on the most important holy day, but though you recognize the traditional garb of pilgrims, this is no ceremony. It is a chaotic, filthy encampment. Who are you? You're from the castle? A tall, bearded man in an old, soiled lector's habit approaches you. Despite the filth, you recognize the altar prior of the temple, Bioka. You relate to him the news from the castle, and all the time looking around, amazed by this peculiar encampment. What are these pilgrims doing here? Exotanaphragus! Bioka reminds you. Of course, when the Izmirs had arrived, the temple had been preparing for the annual ceremony honoring the saintly patron of sailors and fishermen. Those who had come seeking Nafugur's life-giving blessing simply got stuck here. Many didn't even want to flee as they still waited for the ceremony and blessing. How did you manage to survive? The temple walls, as you've seen, are strong. They are a sanctuary and our prison, Bioka smiles grimly. The Izmir aren't even trying to break in. They only ensure we can't get out. They know we're starving. Friend, if you have any food at all, just say what you want in return. How long can you last? Bioka sighs. The forefather so pleases, we will last a while. How long? Never mind that. Ask rather, how many? Not many. Yoko tells you about starvation and diseases, about the daily hardship trying to eke out scraps of food for the masses, hardships you know all too well. Let's try it. Alright, let's see what I can get out of you for all this delicious, awesome food. Armor. Some medicine back so I can trade it to the chick. I really need cloth. I always have a hard time finding cloth. Wow, you really do not want to give me into that cloth. Fine, alright. So there's that, and can I squeeze in any materials? Squeeze in the one material. Alright, so this will be three, four, five, six items, and I can have six slots. So yeah. Uh, am I walking with all your. No, I'm not walking with all your uh, trade goods yet. Okay, so this is all your medicine. Try to try to extract all your medicine first before I worry about other stuff. I'll get the armor, but later I, I want to get all their 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 the commodity that is worth a lot to the other person first, so that I can trade it to the other person and get come back and so forth. Okay, this looks good. 
All right, so I started with maybe, we'll say, three bandages and two medicine. I ended up with more medicine and more bandages. Now that means that I did give away more food. Um, I'm not quite sure if I really did win in this. I, th I think I made a profit, but I'm not entirely sure. medicine and we're gonna, we might have time for one more trade. Okay, so let's see what we can get out of her now. So here's all this medicine. So, take, let's see here, the rest of the food. I'm not 100% sure I made a good profit out of all this, but I think I did. Let's get out of here. The guard goes around this way, otherwise I'd just run that way to the exit. Just gotta make sure I don't run in anybody's patrolling path here, because they, they emerge during the day. And I have better loot to, to sort through on that other side of the, the gate. So we'll leave this food, because we'll trade that to the merchant. We'll take this. Yeah, it's not even a full backpack, but that's alright. Not gonna risk getting caught, that just messes up <laughs> searching in the future, so... 